I'm going to go to the offensive player of the year market. And I'm looking at Derrick Henry at plus 1,600. I basically think that Derrick Henry should be the favorite in all of these markets. I truly have at this point told myself that I really believe Derrick Henry would have won MVP had he stayed healthy last season. I really do. If they would have finished with the one seed and Henry would have stayed healthy, with the pace that he was on, which was another 2,000 rush yards and 20-plus rushing touchdowns, I think it would have won MVP. At the minimum, if he's able to repeat that, he's going to win the Offensive Player of the Year. There's plenty of candidates there, but I don't know if Cooper Cup goes all the way as high as he did last season. I don't think Jonathan Taylor will go as high as he did last season. I understand there's love for Justin Jefferson. We'll see. New head coach, there's a little more assumption there. Christian McCaffrey, the health question that we've talked about a lot. I know what I'm going to get from Derrick Henry. What's the floor, right? 1,800 rush yards, 15 rushing touchdowns with health provided. I think Derrick Henry, as always, is set up for a big season. To get him at 16-1, to Donnie, is a piece that I really like. I mean, if you're talking the floor is 1,800 yards, I mean, geez, this guy's going to be in the Hall of Fame by yes. the end of the season because that <laughs> ceiling is. would be 2,500 yards. And it we'll is. See what happens. But I agree. He's an easy target because he's going to be the, pro- the focus of that offense. And if it's healthy, we know he can really pile up the statistics quickly. So I do enjoy it. But if his floor is 1,800, is. I mean, whoo!